Good morning, YTPC. Monday. Beautiful day. Beautiful morning. Um, you know, being the spring in the Midwest, it's still a little chilly in the morning. Um, I'm getting to the point where I'm not coming out here as early. I'm letting the sun get a little higher in the sky, warm up. Um, pretty active out here. Birds, squirrels, chipmunks, they're all pretty active, so I'll be out here quite a while, probably. Um, many of you are probably wondering why I'm just so interested in squirrels and chipmunks lately. It's because they are not people. That's why. A um, couple things going on today. Uh, I'm, this is not what the video is about. Um, President Trump is back in, he's in court today. I think everything starts today, so you'll be hearing a lot about that, I'm sure. That BS. Um, don't worry about it. This is all a show, folks. I'll, I'll guarantee you right now. It's, uh, there's about as much reality going on with that. It's, it's reality TV. That's what it is. Um, all election interference, pretty much, um, at least that's what I'm hoping. I'm hoping our justice system hasn't fallen as far as what he is trying to kind of portray us, try to get us to believe. I don't know, but, uh, anyway, um... Yeah, didn't make a video all weekend. I did smoke my pipe quite a bit this weekend, though. Um, enjoyed a lot of different tobaccos. Um, got to spend some time with family, which was great. Um, hoping to hear from work, getting a, get some email with some information today about the next trip, if there's going to be one this week. Um, we'll see about that. Anyway, smoking my beautiful 320 Romalusite Savinelli in it. I have more St. Bruno Flake. I'll talk a little more about this blend. I tossed the tin, but I believe this had, it had age on it. If I'm thinking right, it had like three years of age on it. And when I opened the tin, it seemed like it was sealed up pretty well. You know, you'll hear the seal release. And I heard that, but I don't know. This tobacco is a little on the dry side. Um, and when I rub it out, it's brittle. It's, it just feels dry. And I'm one of those people, I don't like that with my tobacco. I kind of like to have a little bit of moisture to my tobacco. I think it tastes better. I don't know. Unfortunately, I only have that one tin, so I might just throw something in there, get get a little bit more moisture to the tobacco. Um, in the in the review video of this stuff. I wasn't detecting much of the Kentucky that's in it. After smoking it some more this weekend, I am um, detecting, at least detecting it um, in a couple different ways. One, the nicotine. There's obviously Kentucky in it because you get a nick hit um, from it. And I'm definitely getting a little bit of it when I'm smoking it now. I don't know what happened the first first smoke, but it's there. 
It's not driving the bus or anything like that, but it's definitely more there than when I first had some. So. Um, I have my little squirrel mix right here on this chair. I got a tray on this chair. And one's kind of been snooping around here. Wanting some, but he hadn't made it over yet. So I hope everyone has an awesome Monday. Is there such thing as an awesome Monday? I'm thinking mine's going to be pretty awesome. Don't really have a whole lot to do going on. Sit outside, enjoy this beautiful weather. <clears throat> Been seeing a lot of videos from the Chicago Pipe Show. Hmm. Something looks a little weird with this. <coughs> hmm. So, yeah. Hope everyone had a great weekend. Um, did a lot of, like I said, I smoked quite a bit of tobacco this weekend. I caught up on YouTube. Um, saw, saw some family members. Uh, it was my nephew's birthday. He was back in town. Did a little bit of shopping for basically for work and the next trip if it hap if it ever happens <laughs> um, did some chores around here had a lot of like nice sized limbs that have been falling off the trees um, big enough where you actually need to saw them in pieces so dispose of them. I was doing that for a couple hours yesterday. Um, but that was really it for my weekend. It was a good weekend. Um, probably the first weekend in a while I haven't made a non-work weekend. I didn't make any videos. Um, I'm thinking about scaling back on how many videos I make a week. I'm thinking about maybe just going to maybe just one. Um, it gets more and more difficult to uh, figure out things to talk about. Um, I can't constantly do tobacco reviews, you know, three or four a week. So that might actually happen. Um, might just pick like Friday for a day to do the video. We'll see, but I'm, I've been thinking about it quite a bit for a while and it's I'm starting to kind of lean toward that idea. Um, views, viewership is kind of going down on videos, so maybe I'm just making too many videos. Um, there's a lot of content creators out there who generally just make one video a week. Some only make like a couple a month. Um, I don't know. I enjoy making videos, but um, sometimes just based on viewership, it's, I'm not quite sure. Um, if I should be making as many videos as I make. Um, yeah, spring is here. Um, neighborhood's absolutely beautiful. We got all the red bud trees blooming, all the, the uh, flowering pear trees blooming, all the trees are starting to uh, bud. They have bud, budded, um, turning green. Uh, yeah. Finally, I think, actually spring in northern Illinois. Visually, 
anyway. Landscapers I see going up or up down the street. Um, a lot of people in this neighborhood, they don't take care of their own yard. I don't. And to each their own. I'm not criticizing about it. But the one thing that does irritate me about that is I'm, if everyone remembers last year we had a neighbor. Of course, we have to use assumptions and work out who we think it was. I have a, I'm about 90% sure I know who it was that complained about our RV in our driveway. It just, they just could not handle it anymore. So they contacted the county thinking that the county was gonna make us get rid of our RV from our driveway. Um, that didn't happen. County showed up, said, yeah, it's perfectly fine. We just had to show up. Um, Ninety percent sure I know who it was and that said neighbor. Yeah, they have a nice yard, beautiful house. But guess what? They don't do any of it. They pay people to come and do your, their yard. They pay housekeepers. I know they got housekeepers show up to clean their house. It's like, that is so hypocritical to me. You expect everyone else in the neighborhood to have this, you know, perfect house, perfect yard, but you don't even take care of your own fucking house. You have other people do it. It pisses me off. If you want to know, the single thing that pisses me off more than anything is hypocrisy. Hypocrites. Can't stand them. Don't want to be around them. Don't care what any of them have to say. And our society is chock full of them. See it every day when I go out. That's why I choose to stay home and feed my squirrels. Hang out with the chipmunks and the squirrels. Because I'm flat out tired of society right now. Tired of rude people. Tired of hypocritical people. Tired of I'm better than you people. I'm smarter than you. It's just... Anyway, are things going to get better? No, I don't think so. Um, yeah, it's uh, like I said, I generally, I didn't really have a whole lot of pipe related um, discussion today. Just wanted to check in with everybody since I didn't all weekend. Apologize for uh, this kind of a negative video. I don't like to generally put out videos that are negative, but a lot of my subs they come here because they like like to hear my opinion. They like to hear, you know, things about me, my life. I like hearing about what's going on in their life. That's not always pleasant. It's not always positive, unfortunately. Um, but on the positive note, I will be enjoying the rest of the day. Smoking my pipe. Um, enjoying the weather. Hopefully hearing back from you. Um, yeah, not a whole lot going to happen today. It's the way I want it. Um, had a busy weekend, so I'm, I'm ready to chill today. Uh, anyway, just thought I'd check in. 
Hope everyone has an awesome Monday. Till next time, keep them lit.